everyone, welcome to another episode of Mike's Garage. So I have a treat for you today. At a car show, there is a complete row of Mach 1 Mustangs. So let me, uh, let me show you so you can take a look. I have never seen five Azure Blue Mach 1s all together at a car show. So let me, uh, let me kind of get into it. All right, so here's the first one at the beginning of the row. So this is a uh, 2003 Mach 1. Uh, it is lower mileage. And look at this, absolutely amazing condition. This is one of the few Mach 1s that did not have the interior upgrade package. As you can see, it has the black pedals instead of the chrome ones. So this is actually a very, very rare uh, Zero Blue Mach 1. Here's mine that everybody's uh, familiar with. So finally got her out and uh, here she is sitting here. So uh, really enjoy having it out. Here's Len's car. Uh, he was able to uh, come on out and park his, uh, his Mach 1 right next to mine. So this is the Mach 1 that was in a previous video that I talked about uh, that was at Bleed 4 Blue Fest. Um, amazing condition. I believe he's got around 7,000 miles on it. So the car looks absolutely awesome. Here is a, uh, a black Mach 1. You don't see too many of these. Um, he did get the powder coated uh, valve covers on it. Um, it's it's a lower mile car. I think he's got maybe uh, 50 some odd thousand on it, but it really is in great shape. You can look at the, the paint, no swirls, no nothing. I mean, it's just very good car. And we've got a yellow one here. This one looks like it's pretty much bone stock. Even has the, uh, the original ear silencer that's right there. Uh, but it's cleaned up really nice. Great shape. And another Zero Blue Mach 1. So let's take a look at this one. This one looks like it's pretty much uh, stock as well. I do see a GL, uh, JLT uh, intake. Uh, they had it painted Azure Blue to match. So it looks very nice. And this is an auto car, which is kind of cool. And it looks like it has the upgraded uh, package for the inside. You can see it's got the uh, chrome pedals on it. Here's a red one. I'll show you the front in just a second. As you can see, looking at the pedals, this one doesn't have uh, the interior upgrade package, which also makes it extremely rare. And the gentleman that owns this actually put the numbers of how rare that it is. So it's one of 325 with that package. And then here's the engine bay. So you can see because it has the, uh, the black valve covers that it's a 2003. And the gentleman that owns this kept every single record, every maintenance on the car since uh, since he bought it new in, uh, in 2003. So very nice car. And another Azure Blue Mach 1. So let's see what this one is. This one is a stick shift. It has the interior upgrade package on it. Appears to be uh, pretty much bone stock, the same as most of them that are on the row. Um, he did cap off right there. So he took off the uh, air silencer, but it looks quite clean. And there's some of the information that's on it. And then finally, let's walk down Mach 1 row and we actually have an orange one. So let me, uh, very nice rims. Let's walk on down. <laughs> let's check out this orange one here. Uh, 
All right, so here it is. Here's some of the details that are on it. So it is a 2004, which is obvious because the orange color was only 2004. And here's extremely clean. These T40th anniversary on it. Very clean on the inside stick shift car. So, absolutely amazing. So I'll give you one more view of Mach 1 Row so you can see it. But this is something with owning my car all these years, I have never, ever, ever seen a row of Mach 1s like this. And five Azure blue ones, it's never happened. So once again, thank you for watching Mike's Garage.